tense moments in College Park as police return to the scene of a deadly home invasion tonight surrounding the property with weapons drawn and our crew initially caught in the middle of all that. I'm Carly Barnett in for Sean Gables. And I'm Rick Fulbaum. Atlanta News First reporter Chelsea Vine for live in College Park tonight where police are continuing their investigation, Chelsea. Well, Rick, we know one man died. Another is in critical condition, but tonight police are still looking for who shot them. Exclusive video shows College Park police surrounding a home with weapons drawn on Thursday night, where they say a fatal home invasion happened less than 24 hours earlier. Police say an armed man was seen entering a home on Princeton Avenue Wednesday night and then seen leaving in an SUV. Investigators say 25 year old Rodney Alfred was shot and killed and a 26 year old man was critically injured. I do know that they were young and it's just a very tragic situation. Neighbors say they're shaken up knowing that a fatal shooting took place on their street. Tonight they watched nervously as police surrounded the house again. <laughs> Eventually, neighbors say investigators ran from the house towards a nearby park and cemetery. Our cameras also captured video of police towing a white SUV from the home. I hope they do find that person. We hope that you know, whoever was involved is able to obviously uh, be held accountable you know, for somebody losing their life. And at this hour, police have not confirmed whether or not they have a suspect in custody. Reporting live in College Park, Chelsea Vine for Atlanta News First. Chelsea, thank you.